Hey everyone, Jacefer here with a tutorial on a simple little car that is easy to construct and fun to build. Let's begin with one 2x10 plate. Now take a 4x4 plate, place it right in the center of the 2x10 plate. Now take two 2x2 two two plates with axles. Let's place one axle on the left and one on the right. Now let's take a 2x2 two two plate, place it on the left axle, and another 2x2 two two plate, place this one on the right axle. Let's take two 1x2 two plates, Place one on the left and one on the right. Followed by two 1x4 plates. Place one on the top and one on the bottom. Let's take two 2x4 two by, by two thirds wheel wells. Place one on the left and one on the right on top of the 2x2 two two plates. Now take another 2x2 two two plate, place it right on top of the wheel well on the left, and a steering wheel. Place the steering wheel on the right side of the 2x2 two two plate. Now take a 1x4 brick, place it on the right. Let's assemble the rear of the car. So take two one by two track elements and a one by two brick. Place the brick on top of the tracks to lock them together. Now take an angular brick and one transparent red round tile. Place the round tile on the angular brick like so. Place this assembly on the left. Let's make another assembly with the angle brick and a transparent round tile. Let's place this one on the right. These are going to be the brake lights and the rear bumper. And simply set the rear assembly on like so. Now take a 1x4 plate, place it on the right hand side of the 1x4 brick, and to finish off the trunk, a 2x4 flat tile. Now let's assemble the front bumper. Take two more 1x2 track pieces, place them side by side. Take four one by one angle bricks, place them on top of the track pieces. Now, a one by two radiator grill. Place it right in the center of the angle assembly. For headlights, let's take two one by one round transparent clear flat tiles. Place one on the left and one on the right. Let's drop the assembly on the front like so. Everything locks together nice. Now take a 2x4 flat tile, place it right on the front for the hood, followed by a 1x4 plate, place it on top of the 2x4 tile. Now this car needs doors, so let's take a left and a right door 
place this door on the bottom and this door on the top, like so. Now we have the interior. Now let's grab two 2x4x2 two by by two windshields. Let's place one for the front windshield and another for the rear. Make sure everything is securely fastened. Now let's assemble the top of the cab. Let's use a 4x4x2 four by four by hood and a 1x2 plate. Place the plate on this side of the hood to fill in the void. Let's place the top of the cab on like so. Now this car needs some tires, so let's grab four small tires, stick them on the axle like so. And there we have the simple little car. It does roll smooth on a flat surface. It has working doors. They even squeak too. Now let's place Jay the Surfer inside. The cab does come off. Let's have him take a seat. It depends on the hairstyle. Apparently his hair is spiked up too much so his it doesn't quite fit. But it is a bit of a tight squeeze. But it is a nice little car indeed. That just means Jay is wearing his hair up a little too high. Might need to get a haircut or restyle it. I used to make these types of cars when I was a child. Very easy to construct and fun to build. Great for a beginner Lego builder. Thank you all for watching.